My time here at UCF has been amazing. Um, I've met some amazing people, but the people that are invested in it, the people that are invested in us as people, and just the opportunities, the things I've been able to accomplish, being able to go to the WNIT, um, being able to just knock down a few different milestones has been amazing to me. I mean, she was the reason why last year we were so good because she bought in immediately. And, you know, she's the most unselfish person, most unselfish player I know, and such a great talent. Um, you know, I'm so happy for her that she's going to leave a great legacy here. Shot fired, up and good as Aaliyah Gregory. I'm a completely different player. I'm pretty sure if all the coaches can attest that if, you know, a lot of people see me before and see me now, they would say that I've grown as a person. Um, from freshman year, I wasn't really starting or I didn't even play a lot my freshman year. And then, you know, to see me, myself today, I'm playing and I'm contributing to the team a lot. Saunders, bullseye as Z Saunders able to connect. And she's done such a great job. I mean, she she is the leader of our team. She's the fire of our team. She's the you know the toughness of our team. She's the scorer of our team. She does so much for us. And you know, having her come with us here, you know, that means a whole lot to our staff. And we want to do so well for her. And she, you know, the team loves her now. And um, it's going to be really hard to let both of them go. Uh, yeah, I've been thinking about it a lot. You know, trying to just stay focused on what we're doing, but. It's, it's kind of scary and weird because, you know, you're going to start the real world, world eventually and you don't know what's up, what's going to happen next. So, but I'm just trying to focus on now and then just enjoy the moment. I think just experiencing different things. Um, anytime things are difficult, you have an opportunity to grow. I think I've had a successful career here at UCF. Um, I wouldn't change it for anything. Um, the coaches that I had the first two years and the coaches that I had for the last two years were amazing people. Um, and I'm glad that I, they played a vital role in my life and my um, growth as a person. Uh, my sole focus is on, um, you know, the games that we have ahead, just one game at a time, and doing what I need to do for my teammates. Um, that's the main thing that I'm focusing on, and I just want to do everything that I can for them this year. That's going to be important for us um, to finish on a high note. Like Coach Abe always says, we do it for our seniors. So um, I think this year everybody's been doing a good job of playing hard for me and Z, um, and making sure that we can go out on a good note. So I think we've been working very hard. We put ourselves in a great position to have postseason play, whether it be um, NCAA tournament or WNIT. I think that our teammates put in the work that we needed to in order to put ourselves in a good position. I'm actually really happy to be here. Um, I'm excited that I decided to make the change to come here. UCF family, the fans, um, the teammates, coaches, the community is just great. And thank you for inviting me and allowing me to feel welcome. I don't think thank you really encompasses how grateful I am for the UCF community. Um, not only my coaches, but the people that were involved from professors to the fans that came to every single one of our home games, away games, whatever the case may be. Um, I think I've grown as a person so much because of the people that are involved around here. Um, and I think this, is, this experience is something that I can never take back. Um, it's a great experience for me. Um, I get choked up kind of thinking about it. but. Um, Coming to UCF was the best decision I've ever made in my life. And I'm glad I came here and I'm glad I met the people that I have here. Um, and I'll always be um, a UCF Knight for the rest of my life.